to Francesca's video blog and I have a, another Dollar Tree haul and this is some really like just household random stuff so um, let me get started this is for um, a brush this is uh, it's called baking uh, a basting brush so um, sometimes I make bread and like the last like 10 minutes while I'm cooking it in the oven, I like to take it out of the oven and brush some um, butter on it, and um, and it makes the crust really soft. So I need a good brush, and so this it gets really good and clean because it's you know rubber and everything, and so I can always you know I feel really I don't like using the ones with like the fur or the, like the the hair or something like that. Whatever it is, I really don't know, but. Um, I really like this better because the other ones I really don't think you know you can really get the the bristles to be cleaned really good. So I like the rubber ones so you can clean them really good. So that I got that. And I stock up on these things because I can really go through um, <laughs> I can really go through a bunch of uh, uh, dish brushes. Uh, for the sink brushes because I really you know tear it up because they get all like flat and and the bristle starts falling off and stuff like that so I can really go through um, a pot and pan brush because I mean I go I scrub it really hard um, so I always keep these you know in handy and they get really dirty like when I cook something with cheese in it and you know then the cheese sticks to the stick to the brush and then it doesn't ever come off so then I feel like it's not clean anymore so then I throw it away so um, so I can really go through some some of these brushes so I bought one two three four five I bought five of them and sometimes if they're not too too dirty like cheese stuck to them I, I I graduate them or degrade them to from the kitchen to the bathroom and I scrub like the bathroom floor with it or the shower floor or whatever and so I just I give it a new job so so I always go through these, and I always try and use them for, for good good stuff. And um, here is some, some tool stuff. I found these in the tool section, and I am trying to build up stuff in my toolbox. I have a really cute pink toolbox, and sometimes when my husband is away at work, uh, and something's broken, I, you know, I can't wait for him to, you know, come home and fix it. Or sometimes it has to be, quick, you know, a quick fix. It has to be quick, uh, fixed quickly or right then and there. So, so I have, I, I have a toolbox to go in and get a tool or whatever instead of go all the way out to the shed or look for his, his tools and wherever he keeps them. So, um, I got this for my toolbox, a ray, um, utility knife and it comes with um, extra spares to put in there it's sort of like a box cutter so to cut things and I bought a bunch of super glue I bought a single use super glue and I bought the gel super glue because sometimes things break and you just have to you know glue it together and I bought a eight in one screwdriver set it has it has the screwdriver of course and then around here I don't know if you can see it with the light and it has all these different little things to put in top of the screwdriver so you can use it to um, unscrew stuff and tighten stuff and then I got some mini scrapers you'll be amazed what you could use for this like Sometimes when I get a picture frame, a really cute picture frame, and it has a sticker right there on it, and you try and take the, the barcode sticker off, it just, you know, doesn't, it like, part of it stays behind. You can use this to scrape it off. Or if uh, some glue gets, you know, dropped on the counter or some hot glue or something while you're doing a craft, you just do this and scrape it off. Just be very careful because they're really sharp, and it's a four. As for it has this little safety thing here, and you take it off. It's like a razor blade. You have to be very careful with it. And then I got some light bulb. I got 60 watt frosted. It has two in one pack. I got two packs. No, I got three packs. Three packs. And um, we can go through some uh, some light bulbs. So 
especially with stairs, she's grabbing the light, the lamps, and then it falls, and the, and the light bulb, the thing goes bad with it. Um, this is also for my toolbox, a hacksaw. Um, sometimes I have to like get, um, have to cut like a piece of cabinet or something like that like, if we're fixing it or whatever. So this will get into some small little spaces. So, and then also I got a handsaw. I know they're a dollar. I don't know if they really work very well. So um, next, you know, DIY project, you know, I'm going to give this, give, give, give this puppy a try. Let me see what it looks like. Let me see how the teeth on it look. It's taped on there. And they're really sharp. They get a good grip. So I know that's weird. You know that what's a girl going off getting a a hacksaw and a handsaw. So, but you know, just to see, just to keep around the house. I'm not gonna do anything bad with it. I promise. And um, let's see what else we have. This is for my car. I bought a USB charger and a USB cable. And I'm going to keep this in my car to, um, to, to charge my phone with or my, uh, my Nook or my husband's Kindle, you know, anything. His phone, my phone, somebody else's phone. And let's see, I got some more super glue. This is 30% more super glue. But this one you can use for more than just one thing. You can use this for metal, for wood, for plastic, and for nails. And it must be really good for nails. And it's really good to keep this handy because you never know when you'll need it. Here's some more tools. I got a set of four screwdriver sets. And some, some short ones and long ones, and they are flat heads and two two flat heads. The red ones are are the flat heads, and the blue ones are Phillips Phillips screwdrivers. So um, I think I got another screwdriver. And these are tweezers, a set of tweezers. I'm gonna keep this in the um, in the toolbox because sometimes if I'm like uh, cleaning out the the long, um, yeah, like the laundry lint catcher sometimes there's lint stuck all in the in the bottom part of the lint where it goes through the lint catcher and I clean like the vacuum cleaner um, what is it called beater bar where it spins at the bottom and my hair gets stuck on it so sometimes I have to take the, my hair off the beater bar so I really need those sometimes and I think that's all the tools that I bought oh no I got one more Two more. I got two more tools. I got a set of six precision screwdrivers, and these are really good to have, especially if you have a baby that um, when they have a new toy and you have to unscrew that teeny, teeny, tiny little screw to change the <laughs> change the batteries on stuff, like um, anything, like uh, the um, the the thing that we have sitting or it's strapped to her crib and she can push the button and it starts singing music to her and everything like that and it has a really teeny tiny screwdriver and you have to go find that teeny tiny screwdriver to change the battery so she can go back to sleep so you definitely need those and the last tool is <laughs> a crowbar <laughs> um i know that's you know really weird to have a crowbar in your house but we really needed this when we were working on the back porch and the um, the the planks, I guess that's what they're called, of wood. They, they were the nails were so corroded and so rusted that we couldn't get. And they were screws. They weren't nails. They were screws. And so you couldn't get it out, and you couldn't get the screw out with the screwdriver because the um, it was so rusted it wouldn't grab a hold of the screw. And so we were like trying to pull it out with a hammer and everything like that and with another stick. So we really needed this to get that plank of wood out. So next time we need to, you know, replace a plank of wood on the deck, we got a crowbar. So <laughs> I know that's weird, but uh, but I saw it. I was like, oh, we really needed this last summer. So I got it. And this is for Sarah, a mirror magnet to put on the refrigerator. 
something so she could just grab and put back on because she's really starting to be interested in the refrigerator now. And for a continuation for the kitchen, I bought some more. I got like four of these. I got a black one, I got a white one, a red one, and um, yeah. And so, that, and I got another red one because uh, I ended up I ended up leaving them in things like the flour container. I ended up leaving the cup measuring in the flour. I'll just leave this in here because next time I'll need a cup of whatever. So that's what I do. But I or lose them. I always lose them. Sarah goes in the drawers and gets them out and hides them places. And I got two bowls, two small bowls. So for this, for like cereal and stuff like that. We only have two small bowls um, right now. And, and then we have like four large bowls. And the large bowls are like really big. They're like that big. So, and we always ended up needing some smaller bowls. So we got these. So we can have small bowls for things like ice cream and cereal in the morning. And this is some girly stuff now I have. I saved that for last. I got some hair wraps. And I love just sometimes just putting my hair back and um, getting all these little little tiny flyaways now that I cut my hair. I have, um, I guess you call these bangs, some really long bangs. So. And, um, and I just put my hair in. I like to put these back up sometimes. Put, use it for my hair. And um, let's see. I have some nail. Enamel nail art. It is um, nail bejeweled strip. That's what it's called. So I'm going to put these. Um, I'm going to put these on my toes. And see see how long they last. And see. It's, um, it's like a like a diamond with a little jewel kind of design and it's purple. I don't know if you can see if it's purple. I don't know, maybe. But it's purple. And I got some earphones for me. Uh, they're pink and it's zebra stripes. Something to have while we're going on a trip or whatever. And I got a brush with a um, Forget what kind of stone you call this. Pedicure set. Doesn't say what kind of stone. But it's that really soft stone, like to um, to rub against the heel of your foot, and it really makes your skin really soft. So um, I'm gonna use that. And that is almost it. I have two more things. Um, I got some more sticky notes. I love sticky notes, and these were so cute. I had to get them. They were so girly. One's a, um, a zebra's dress in the back. You see, this is the top, and it goes, this is the waist, and then it comes down. And then here's another set of sticky notes with a mirror and a red lipstick. And then a high heel sh um, boot right here, shoe. And they're all zebra, and it's real girly. I think it's so cute. So I got it. And I got a brush. This is for Sarah because she loves taking the brush and she'll always take the brush, turn it backwards and try brushing her hair. It's so cute. But she's always doing it backwards so she's never really brushing her hair. So I got the um, the round brush. So if she picks it up, you know, no matter what she does with it, no matter which way she turns it, she's always brushing her hair. So I thought that was cute that she was already trying to brush her hair. She just turned one on the 11th and today's what the 13th so that was two days ago so she just turned one so she um so i'm wondering what she's going to do she's napping right now so i wonder what she's going to do but that is my haul i hope you liked everything um leave a comment below give a thumbs up give it a good like and subscribe so you can see some more of my videos and um stay tuned for more thanks bye